Well, this looks like a fun new way to injure myself. Things that can seriously injure you are always put in this impossible packaging, and I wonder if that's a coincidence or not. It's probably a good thing. General instructions and preparation. Don't need that for this dangerous possible weapon. Anything can be a weapon if you're creative enough. Disclaimer, I'm not suggesting anyone use a craft hot knife to hurt themselves or anyone else. Please don't do that. Please get help. I just have a Wednesday Adams sense of humor, okay? I do like stabbing. He's got a little kickstand. Oh. Is that how you... Well, that seems very unstable. Kinda like my mental status. Do not touch any metal parts when the tool is plugged in. It's hot! <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> you know, like the fact that it's called a hot knife and the front of the package says 950 degree tool wasn't enough. Who's this made by? Walnut Hollow, you are steel clad against any lawsuits, I would say. They made it idiot proof. Works best when used with tempered glass mat. This is glass from a picture frame that I didn't need. That's close enough, right? Disclaimer, don't try this at home. Oh my god, it's crackling. <laughs> I'm not afraid... Well, I guess I'm kind of... I'm afraid of being burned by something this hot. What really scares me is fire. I'm terrified of fire. Like Frankenstein level of terrified of fire. If I were the caveman that discovered fire, we still wouldn't be able to cook our food. It never would have happened. Oh my god, it keeps popping. <sighs> I don't know if it's supposed to do that. <laughs> so I've rolled up my sleeves, tied my hair back, moved pretty much everything that could potentially catch fire. Fire bad. And I have a cup of water on standby. hot enough yet? You guys, I'm scared. Well, that didn't work. Oh no, <laughs> I connected it to the glass. <laughs> Whoa. Screw the blade, man. Oh my god, that works so freaking well. I mean, there, there's some smoke, and I don't like that, but I mean... It does say that residue will get on it, and there's residue, but it, it says that that happens, and I, I don't think it's any worse than what happens when I do it with a lighter, which involves an open flame, which I hate. 
I also feel like I have more control with this. Oh, this one's gonna be hard. That's a big one. She's a big one. Okay, so, again, as I said, proceed with definite caution. I'm not going to tell you that you should try this, because I don't want to be liable for anything. I mean, the company that makes this hot knife definitely isn't liable for anything, because this isn't what you're supposed to do with it necessarily, but I will say it works really well. <laughs> um... I will definitely give an update if it turns out going terribly wrong when I try further experiments, but it has worked just so well. But yeah, definitely proceed with caution, and if anything bad happens, you didn't hear it from me.